Today's best music. Magic 89.9. Uh, welcome to the show. It is a Wednesday morning at 7.39 here all over Manila. And we have a new co-host with us for today. Or not today, just today tomorrow. And maybe a couple. Let's just say I'm here. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Delamar, what are you doing here, girl? Oh! 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 I, I, think I have it, to get it had... used to that. <sighs> Crazy. It had something to do. Mo asks, "Hey, what are you doing here?" It had something to do with you twisting yeah. my arm yeah, to get, you know. I, I had to. So really, what do you mean? I really had to what muster up here? like the highest level of my nip- manipulative powers to like yeah. just kind of will her. I to felt say it. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And Can I just tell you? Yeah. You you tweeted something that like su- you said something like. Uh, I was afraid that Susie might scare you <laughs> off the show. Yeah. And at the back of my mind, really? Susie. Yeah, Susie. That's how he deflects. He's good at that. Be careful. You will see. No, you will see. You will see that I will be, I think I will be the one you like most on the show. Oh wow. I doubt that. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And then maybe Dora. <laughs> yes. Definitely not. No. Definitely not Mikey. Not Mikey. And no. You're going to hate Susie Mikey. Mikey. When you say, when you say, yeah, no. <laughs> I'm gonna hate Mikey. Gonna hate Mikey. We'll, t- we'll get into it a little bit later. later. Okay, <laughs> he's a, he'll show you himself. Don't, don't preempt it. Let it unfold. Yeah, his, his very evil qualities come in about. It takes about thirty minutes. <laughs> Wait a minute, Susie. When you say he's gonna show himself, I hope this has nothing to do with on cam thing. Well, that's why we're on Zoom. No, well, he's, he's a, a Wednesday. He's Usually a week weekends here in Nagawa, so we're safe. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, and 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 I know you might be a little excited about it, Del, because uh, Mikey here is thirty years old, right in your range. Wow. Opa, you're gonna be the least hated one right there. Right there in your right there yeah. in your comfort zone. Tell <laughs> you what's happening right now. Mo is trying to poke the bear. He thinks if he pokes me, we got a show. Oh, it's literally yeah. her All right. third anyway. minute well, on with us, and she already wants I'm to go. I know. Up. I'm warming. Okay, up. wait a minute. Uh, Susie, thir- third minute uh-huh. mark uh-huh. was the first Insult. shot uh-huh. fired, uh-huh. right? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh-huh. That's the first to day one, Del Zero. <laughs> <laughs> all right, hold on. I got to type something to Susie there. Sorry, I must all caps. I just to lower Mikey's uh, volume a got little you. bit. I think he... Oh. Okay, we lost you. We lost you. We lost you 100%. Okay. Take, there we're you go. You're, this. Oh, goodness. Sorry. You're a robot. We're, okay, we're back. Sorry. Yeah, so this is the first time we're doing this with multiple machines and this many people. So... I mean, as Del, as, as an, a good impression is what we want to kind of uh, give with you here. There's going to be, I think, some technical issues as we kind of kind of warm up here. So just let's all be patient with it. Mm. But I still think we're going to have a great time because Delamar is freaking Delamar. Susie yesterday on the show said, best of all time. Best of all time. No, true. that's not true. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's true. Wait, did you just say, Mikey, you disagree? The goat. Did you say disagree? I told you you are going to hate him. No, I said the Mikey. goat. First of all, <laughs> six minutes. He, he just called you an animal. animal. Mikey hates the gays. Yeah. Mikey hates the poor. <laughs> Mikey, Mikey yeah. hates Visayas as well. <laughs> Mikey hates, Mikey hates public public over schools. Okay. Mikey hates the poor. Mikey, okay. Mikey doesn't like barefoot basketball. Oh, no, Mikey. Yeah, and and here's the kicker. Del, this is the part that you're gonna love most about him. As a UP educated uh, woman of, of your uh, Oh, prestigious, no. uh, <laughs> prestigious, econ- oh my God. Your, your, your prestigious um, educational background. Mikey here, like Dora, <laughs> all of you are UP. Now, yeah. what's great about Mikey is <laughs> <laughs> thesis, <laughs> the only thing, the only thing that UP wanted from Mikey because he was their star player was to come to class. That's it. That is it. <laughs> Professors. Did you take the upcut? Did you take no. the upcut nope. at all? No, he didn't. <laughs> you got in <laughs> with Mikey, sports. Oh my God. Yeah. Ang sabi pala sa'yo, come to class. Mm-hmm. Sorry. Hindi come in. T- ah, okay. Uh, I think uh, Mikey misunderstood uh, that part. Hi, hi. Ano pala? So, classroom. Eh. What's up, Mikey? Hi. Yeah. <laughs> this is, pr- this is the, re- the number one reason why Dora dislikes Mikey so much. Uh, it, just, uh, it was a different effort. It was a different yeah. effort. Every day is Mikey. Cool. You are gonna. Oh, it's fun. It's fun to watch. Yeah. It's fun to watch. Oh my. Okay, Mo, can you it's tell a, them what Dora did? What Dora did yesterday on Instagram? 
his microaggression. <laughs> okay, well, yeah. So, yeah. So, so Dora, Dora's posting about okay. his radio career, his learning of the the music, the board, and all of that stuff. He refuses to acknowledge that Mikey's part of the show. So, he just <laughs> micro aggressively does not tag him on any of. No, no, no. That's not microaggression. <laughs> that's micro passive aggression. <laughs> There are exactly layers to this. <laughs> so now, now I know I know it sounds like we have a lot of people on the show, but what I think we need one more person because Dora doesn't like Mikey. Delamar hates me. Susie, you don't have an enemy on the show. Come on. No, no, no. I don't hate you. I don't hate you. Okay. No, I do not no, hate we you. I loathe you. <laughs> Oh my god, it's me and Delamar versus you every day. That should be fun, no? Oh my yes, god. I, I already uh, warned let's Delamar forge about this you. Alliance. I warned Delamar about you. It's going to be different, trust me. All right. Anyway, welcome to the show. 8631 is our phone number if you want to call us, get yourself on the program. We're only on until 9 o'clock. I know we're still in COVID hours here, but it should be a very high quality hour and 20 minutes as best of all time Delamar has sat here and joined us. Now Del, you're going to be here tomorrow as well and I think for a couple of weeks and you know this is the haggling that Delamar, Delamar and I were talking about so she's like okay fine you twist my arm I'll try the show once a week and I was like how dare you it's either twice a week or nothing and she's like oh. and so she's agreed to, to be here Wednesdays I can and see how that's not how it went down she didn't say Sorry, no, Del you can't do that that's not how it went. Okay, I'm, please, I'm guessing after please. this uh, guesting stint, if I don't say yes, alam mo magkaaway parin tayo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, lang yan. Uh, you gotta have some friends and a few enemies. Fair so, enough. You know. Fair enough. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm just there. teasing. Uh, all right, but but okay. So Delamar, I was talking, I was talking to the to Dora about this because this is a segment, not really a segment. We've done this topic maybe once or twice in the past. And we haven't done it yet with, De- uh, with Dora here. We haven't done it yet with Mikey nor you. So, Tin, you're familiar with this. Thank you. You, yes. you call Delamar the greatest of all time. Mm-hmm. And she's got a very distinct uh, name. You don't come across many Delamars uh, in, in the world, right? Um, Del's fine. Delamar's not really. So I thought... No, it, ma- ma- no ma- madalas yan sa Batangas, mga probinsya. Yung name Delmar? ng mga bakery. Oh, oh, Delmar Bakery. Delmar. Delmar. Oh, Delmar. Uh-uh. Yeah. Delmar. In Palawan, I, I, say, I, know, Delmar. I know all of this. Yeah, but these are these are there. these are locations and bakeries. <laughs> 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 well, you know, I'm saying my name is only distinguishable because my parents gave me the weirdest name possible. Right, right. Is it a right? combination of imagine names? a seven year old? Totoo. Uh, Correct. Uh, yes. Oh. Okay. yes. Right. Yesterday. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you like going by the whole name, or did you? Dell's cool with you. You're fine with Dell because no, it's a bit he, more common. We're going to have to cover this, right? So my name is Delamar. It's so weird. It's a combination. But all of the siblings have Mars in their name. So the <laughs> running joke in my family is we've all been marred. <laughs> oh, <laughs> So yeah. there's right. Edelon, Mar, Paul, Mar, Sam, Demar, Delawan. Delamar, Mar, Sam, Demar, Mar, Sam, Demar, 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 my radio brain has to, you know, it's still um, heating up. Diesel yan eh. Sige, right. okay. <laughs> but yeah, so that's why my name is Delamar is because of all this. Anyway, please don't compliment me na 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 we weird na ako. Parang I don't know. Gusto ko magtago sa bulse. Okay, well, really? well here, here's here's a way to not compliment you. So mm. we we again we do we oh, do no. we've done a topic here where who holds the fame? Who's the most famous person that holds okay. our name? Uh-huh. Get it? Mm-hmm. Get it? Like, are we the most famous Mo? Are we the most ah. famous Del? Are we so? And if not, who is the answer to that? So there's one, two, three, four, five of us here. Five names. Let's throw out our name and let's try to find out who the most famous person who owns our name is. So Philippines Dora, lang, no? local you, lang talo tayo. <clears throat> Sana local, but with Dora, clearly, oh. I mean, the explorer <laughs> is uh-huh. so I famous. Uh-huh. Yeah. I know. So famous. I actually, this is what I said about you when you first came on the show. I love you. I think you're funny. I think you're energy. You're smart. You're educated. (laughs) But your name, man. (laughs) You mean the one thing he can't do anything about? No, he can't because his name is Jose and he ruined it. (laughs) He ruined it. But it goes so dark. No way, Jose. Jose. I don't think we can have a Jose here. Okay. Yeah. That's like that. Why not? No, I mean that. He can't go by Jose. 
Di ba, guys? Parang hindi okay, ko fine. I'm okay with that. But, but <laughs> <laughs> okay. So give me, give me other. So let's 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 do the top three Doras in the country and let's see if Dora is one of them. Number one, I'll say Explorer. Alam ko hindi siya Pilipino pero hindi din siya human. Let's just go with Dora. <laughs> Dora the Explorer. I would say Kimmy Dora. Kimmy Dora. Kimmy Dora. Kimmy Dora. Oh, Kimmy Dora. Who's more famous though? Kimmy Dora or Dora? Our, our Dora. It's Kimmy Dora. Dora. Kimmy Dora. That's MMFF. Kimmy Dora. Mase. Tita yung ka. Ininsulto ka din. Kimmy naman. Yeah. <laughs> Who's, oh. So this is this is passive. Was it micro passive? Micro micro. <laughs> Microaggression. Micro passive aggression. Okay. okay. So who's the most famous Dora? Is Kimmy Dora more famous? Dale's like, Shimpre! Kasi masa! No masa! Kasi masa! Oi! Wait a minute! Do- Jose! Have you had a movie based on your name? No, Not yet. But Eugene Domingo has, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay. So, Mas- do, do you disagree, galing, galing. Jose? Galing. Natatakot naman ako. <laughs> No, no. Okay. Okay. Ako, ma- ako ganito? Tomorrow I'll show you my spears. <laughs> yeah, um, you, you don't know this about Dora, but Dora, yeah, his father is a hunter gatherer so, and <laughs> tends to go out. <laughs> Spears animals for dinner. It's really oh intense. And yet you get the most flamboyant child <laughs> of a hunter gatherer. It's actually no, kind of cool. I thought it was like a a, um, a double entendre kind nope. of thing. Like literally, uh, he, I will show you my spear. Oh, uh, please, I'm married. <laughs> <laughs> no, that he, no, that'll never happen. Obviously, with Dora. Okay, so Dora, at least are you at least top three? You th- are we gonna say Dora's the third most famous Dora? Yeah, in the yeah. yeah, I would say that yeah. too. Simply because. I'm top three out of the three choices. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> All right. Here's a tough one. Here's a tough one because Mikey. Mikey's a pretty common name. Yeah. Uh, Juanco. Mm-hmm. Uh, Morada. Morada. Bustos. Bustos. Morada. Mm. Bustos. 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 Solana. Wait, 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 over. Number one. <laughs> Me and my aunts are more famous so. than you. <laughs> <laughs> so who's the most famous Mikey? I'm gonna go Kuanko, even Kuanko. though she's kind of been out of the circulation for a while. She left such an impression. I think when and you hear the word one, for the name Mikey, right? Yeah. Kuanko. Right. You think Caballo, Equestrian, yep. Aga. Like yeah. there's a lot there, right? Right. Is she still the top Mikey in the country though? Yeah. Depends on which generation you're talking to. Right? Absolutely. Mikey? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So yeah. But, oh, who so, else? Is the young, you're probably the hottest Mikey. Oh, <laughs> yeah. no. To the very young. Sexual tension. Mikey Morada. It's to the very young. Is that Morada, Dora? Who's that? Morada, Mikey Morada. Yeah. Alex. Alex. Alex's husband. Alex's husband. Alex Gonzaga's husband. You can't. You're more famous than him. No. I wouldn't say he's famous. Alex is kind of. Because of Alex. A huge deal. You have to get an Alex. Mikey, you gotta get an Alex. Yeah. Hey. He's got, got two Alexes. <laughs> I, uh, I, I, I'm going to say you're more famous than him. I, I get it, the, the, the famous by association. But, I mean, you famously bricked two huge free throws at the end of that <laughs> Ateneo game. That had In a, a UP l- jersey. Huge. Yeah. In a UP jersey. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, let's go. So, I'm going to go Juanco Arroyo Bustos as the third. Yeah. Arroyo. yeah. That's Arroyo. fair. Yeah. Yeah, Juanco right. Arroyo, Arroyo Bustos. Right. Yeah. And then Re- Reyes is next. Uh, I think Romero. Mm, Mikey Romero, 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 that's Romero. right. Romero. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Medyo Mikey. Oh, top five ako in, uh, in six. <laughs> I, ooh, that's bold. That's ambitious. A <laughs> <laughs> feeling more. What the 11? 11, 12. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go to Tin. Tin, who's Tin? tin. Uh, just Tin, right? It's not. Okay. It's not Tin Tin. Cause it's Tin Tin. Yeah, in Metro, you know, you're it's expanding the, the, the selection. Tin. Isn't it? Yeah, but yeah. you go by Tin. You yeah. don't go by Tin Tin. Neither true. do you go by Christine. That's true. So, Bersola. 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 Are, are, are we? Are we in agreement? Bersola. Uh, Bersola yeah. Yeah. For sure. Who else? Um, and Tin then Tin Gutierrez. Do we actors Tin Tin Gutierrez? Chin Chin, you angot. <laughs> chin Chin, you <yon. laughs> Sorry. Chin, chin. And then there's Yap. Yeah. Yeah. Chin. <laughs> Tin Yap. <laughs> Tito <laughs> Joe. Si, ano? Dor- Dora with the Tito Joke. Chin M Y M V. No. Oh, that's right. That's right. Oh my gosh, ang daming Tin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no one, no one really truly famous, no, for such a common name. Thin. This is I usually think precisely Christine. that because it's such a common yeah. name. I mean, they made me you know, change it. You become because it's so common, right? They made me yeah. change it for Susie, right? Yeah, because mm, it was oh, that, too that was short, though, and forgettable. Yeah. yeah. 
If it was Susie, who is the most famous Susie? Entrada. Ay. Susie. Susie. Oh, that's right. Mars. Mars. See, Mars. Oh, yeah. Susie. That's right. See, Susie and Jeno. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Sorry. Susie. Dated. Dated. Susie. At least, at least Tins like Landa, hottest of the Susies out there. Um, uh, Susie and Prada. Del. I think you are. Okay, let's go with Del. Not Del Amar. Okay, wait, let's go with Del. Wait, who's hot? Susie. Sorry, yeah, I got Susie. confused. Look at this. You got basketball players from all oh around the world wanting some of that. Gender DMs. You have oh, NBA. Oh, you have. 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 I'm sorry. I have to interject here. Uh, uh, okay. Delamar. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Good luck. Just so you know. Okay. <laughs> Delamar watches every single jazz. No way. Beginning. Oh well, yeah. Your husband well, owned a owned a sports bar here, yeah. so he he's a yeah. sports fan. Yeah. Delmar's a jazz yeah. fan. Wow. Okay. Oh my. I'm, by default. By default. Can I just nevertheless, say, you still watch everything. I'm in the presence of like uh, Tan knows basketball. Mm-hmm. Mikey's there. I know nothing about basketball. So the only reason I attend is because I'm the wife, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. And then he tries to force it on me. So, but COVID <laughs> no more. Champere. But pre COVID. Oh my God. If live, there's a jazz live, game, we're gonna watch it. Live, yeah. You'll be yeah. there. Live. Yeah. Season oh. tickets. Yeah. Season tickets. Oh, hardcore. So hardcore. Wild. So who's hardcore. your favorite player? Yeah. Can I just tell you a story? Go. Yes, okay, and then we'll I tell you none. one. We got one for okay, you, too. So, this was, I would say, <laughs> probably 2019. I know. <laughs> no, we got a story for you. Yeah, go, go. Mm-hmm. So, we, we would go to these games. That's great. And then this one season, um, LeBron was going to play in Utah. So I was like so excited. The one time, the non basketball fan <laughs> whose knowledge of basketball is just, you know, uh, the stuff that lands in mainstream, right? Other than that, I don't know anything. So I was excited, like, oh gosh, I'm going to get to see this guy play. And he got tickets that were like on the second row. Wow. Wow. Look at, you. Look at that. Right? Yes. I was so excited until he said, um, I go, what time do we leave? Oh, um, I'm going to take my friend. <laughs> <laughs> so I go, wait. So I go, it's okay. You bought three tickets, right? Because it costs $1,000 <laughs> for all these tickets. So, syempre, yung the wife and me, we're going to magdaldal about the cost, okay? Yeah. Don't nag him, but just just be happy. Okay, I'll take the other ticket. No, no, the brother of my friend oh. is going to watch it. <laughs> Oh, so the no. one time that you I was actually wear. excited, oh, man. Na- oh, oh, oh. I got kicked. Uh, yeah, I got kicked oh. onto the curb, and I was like, "What?" <laughs> but the the killer was. I was about to say, "Wait a minute! I've I paid my dues. I deserve to watch <laughs> LeBron <laughs> play." And he goes, <laughs> "I know." This is, you know what he said? He said, "No, my my friend is is really really sick. That's oh. why I'm giving him the ticket." Oh. <laughs> The charity. So how it's can I how make can a whisk program? <laughs> uh, uh, no, but it was Dora true. It was also people. true. But <laughs> <laughs> he also hates the sick. <laughs> yeah. So. so 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 Del. Now it's our turn to share a Utah jazz story, yes. and All this right. this is going to be very close to your heart yeah. because mm-hmm. uh, Susie is renowned. Not um, renowned. Oh, I know. You would be very careful. close to basketball players, right? Very in demand. No, to basketball that's players. hard. Way to put it. No, no, no. And and you know what? It's not like they're even gentlemen about it. They just I don't know what they do. There's a level of disrespect that they jump into um Susie's DMs already what? half nude. Already no, half nude. That's not true. Okay. So get into it. There was a certain NBA basketball player who came to Manila, right? And really was just fascinated with Susie. He was dating a Victoria's Secret oh model at the time and oh it did God. not stop him from texting her and going, it's, I don't know what time was it, at the end, was it about 1am? 1am, midnight, they're oh, about to take, yeah. right? 4am? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, girl, after the disrespect. Yeah. After party. The disrespect. Oh we just, we okay. had just gotten home from a night out. Yeah, yeah, that was a night out. Okay, so 4am, excuse me. Okay. He texts her and says this, the, the cheesiest line you'll never hear from an NBA player, but he did it. Okay. I can't sleep here in this hotel room without someone. <laughs> oh, God. Would you oh. come over? Would you come over and help put me to sleep? Oh, my God. Something, something, something. Oh, my God. Yeah. 
Rookie, um, rookie, yeah. Susie being Susie immediately screenshots that and sends it to all of us. <laughs> <laughs> and for the record, I did not go. I did not go. Oh, yeah, she did not go. You but, wasted but, that, DM. Damn, damn, what, are you, what are you thinking? I'm that not was, a one night stand yeah. kind of girl. That was before the fifty yeah. million dollar contract. So <laughs> yeah, that was before the guys signed the He's still, okay. he's still on the rookie, and ro- yeah, rookie, rookie money. money. <laughs> right. Oh my gosh, so, Jane. Kuma eh. Kardashian ka. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Kardashian uh, sounds like the Philippines. <laughs> I remember, so we were so, in the club, right? We were, we were like, we, we were walking out, and he was holding my hand. And these Ew. effers all around the club were screaming at me, Laban Pilipinas! <laughs> puso! <laughs> Hashtag puso. <laughs> Laker game. Oh, so, oh my gosh. She, she, turns, she turns him down. She turns him down. and But of course, you know, nice lets us know way. about it. Like, lets I mean, us know about how it. Do, wait, how does one turn down an, an NBA player's booty call? I don't know. Is there a manual for that? <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Mikey, Mikey <laughs> myself, and Dora will all look at the screenshot that she has sent us five, five times through the years. And let's read what you... <laughs> I no, never said it down? to Dora though. Uh, how did yeah. you turn him down, Tin? Uh, no, because uh, I was working. Like I had, I was gonna interview him the next day for a show, for our show, Mo. Mm, so mm, mm. I didn't want to do that, right? It would be so weird. So she said, you, "No, it's integrity, okay, just- journalist." <laughs> after, after the show, excuse me, excuse me, Maria. <laughs> no, it's true. Look at you. With your- so I said, "No, Wait, did you like him? How can uh, you not?" And I was single, you know. But I also know. Okay. So that's a yes. Yeah, I did. I did. Like we were really getting oh along. God. Like we really clicked. Like that was the I think the third oh day God. that we were hanging out. He was just couldn't sleep. So said said uh, NBA player who is never going to be named because we try to keep it as secret as possible <laughs> even though Jordan Clarkson scored 40 for you guys and the other day. U- the Utah Jazz just... <laughs> right? I know, you're right. He's having an Clarkson amazing year. J- drops 40 I, on, on, on whoever... What was it? Milwaukee or something yeah, like that the other day. Um, so do me do me this, Del. When you get to your next jazz game and all the COVID stuff sits down, you know, simmers down and you're in that second row seat that your husband so willingly dishes money out for can you go I work with her <laughs> and then just <laughs> a big photo <laughs> okay so yeah. it wasn't I'm gonna, like I'm about go it, I, it wasn't dirty or anything really it was just like, what? what it wasn't a dirty I can't he was, sleep I in can't my hotel sleep. come here I can't even pick you up <laughs> I'm not even hey, to pick you up Hindi, pero syempre Amerikano yun eh. Tama ba? Yeah. So syempre ba yung courtship rules, di ba? Yeah. I don't think he said anything out of line. Yeah, it was an agree. invitation. Yeah, oh walang, walang pero pag, are sinabing are you dumero. Pero pag Pinoy, tinext ka ng saan ka, you, you already know. Lam na. 2 a.m. Yeah. Oh, saan ka. Iba yun. Gising ka? Uh-huh. Gising ka ba? Gising ka ba? You up? <laughs> you up? <laughs> Where are you? You... <laughs> And you then, up as I am, yeah. <laughs> and then you up because she knows Susie will get ex- they know Susie will get excited. It's U A A P U up. Wow, I'm up for that. I didn't see Mikey. It's poor people. All right. So did you wait? There's a hanging question. Tin, do you do you um do you regret not saying yes? <laughs> When he signed oh, the fifty million dollar contract, how many question. people sent okay, me that screenshot? Need, when I was single, I like that, siguro mga that a year for a whole year after that. It's like, oh my gosh, sayang. May kwento ka saan? <laughs> oh, sayang. Sayang. Pero, uh, I'll always have that. <laughs> I said no. I'll I always said no. have that. Always have that. We'll always have Manila. <laughs> <laughs> a part of me, a part of me does not, until this very day, and not just because obviously we're, you know, we exaggerate here on the show, we try to make fun and all that stuff, but legitimately, okay, this, I'm, I'm seriously, a part of me does not believe you didn't go. And, no, I really didn't. I, no, no, I know you didn't. Okay. I know that's yeah. the press release. I know that that's what we've been saying for years. There is a huge part of me that does not believe that. That's because so it's just way too, it's just way too delicious of a treat. <laughs> <laughs> it's just way too. You know, spoken like a true man. You have no idea what it takes. How dare you, Del? For the last five minutes, you're like, girl, how come you didn't go? Oh my God, what a hard, uh, what a hard thing to say. No, 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 no. Like I, I, no, I, I understand, I, that, as a woman, as me and 
as me talking to Tin Tin. Yeah. You know, do you regret it as a woman? Pero Shabri, you don't understand what it takes for a girl of tin size yeah. to be sleeping with an NBA player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you yeah. are the receptacle. As a woman, you're going to have to receive all of that. Oh, my yeah. God. Don't tell me you're it's not gonna scared. You're going to eat it. You're going to your part. I, I, it was real. Okay, honestly, it was more... Uh, Del, 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 Jordan Clarkson, baka di mo alam, half Filipino yan. Half I know. Filipino. Baka normal lang pala. I know he is. Baka sinasabi mo na ganito kalaki si Boy, pero pagdating sa parang datang, parang patanga sa isla. Longganisa. <laughs> 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 no, kasi, okay. The night before, so when we were like, as in, as in we were really like, we were vibing. Yeah, we were. As in super friends. He FaceTimed pa his girlfriend, introduced me to the girlfriend oh, on FaceTime. Oh, Ganon kami ka, ka-friends. The disrespect. The disrespect. Uh, disrespect. Ganda yung girlfriend. Disrespect. That's the hard part. Yeah, that's Kasi girlfriend eh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Peritin, oh, the, the reason you didn't want to si go Chanel was... Iman. I know. Because you had work, not because he had a girlfriend. No, that was already weird to me. Everything was weird. Uh, Everything was just... Yeah. And then, right. I've never done anything like that with anyone in my life. So, okay. I think it but, was... But, which but part? The, 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 the one night stand stuff. But but the, the icing on the cake is, so he gets declined by Susie. He goes out and guess who he dates right after that? Kendall Jenner. <laughs> yeah. like, like the wow. week after. Got nothing. Got nothing. Pictures. Got nothing. <laughs> Kendall Jenner. Oh. Dating Kendall Jenner. From BG. Right. What year to? 2015. What year? 2015. From BGC 2015. to... 2015. Okay, so Michelle. I'm gonna have to research who Kendall... What month is this? Summer. I just no, need to no, know. No, no, no. If you want, you want to do the Kendall timeline, it's in between which ballers were she dating at this time. This is this is after Blake Griffin, prior Ben Simmons. <laughs> yes, exactly. Prior, okay, okay. Exactly. Before Ben right. Simmons. Way before, before Devin Booker. Before Kyle, Kyle Kuzma. Before Booker, Grabe before siya, no? Simmons, before Kuzma, but after Blake. So Amazing. that's 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 the Kendall time. Yeah, okay. And Susie wow. right up there. Oh, man. So so Del, real quick, just to finish this up, who's the most famous Del in the country? I'm gonna go Delamar <laughs> over Del Ramos. Dora said yes. Del Ramos, who I've never heard in my Del life. Ramos. Who's that? Del Ramos. Who the hell's Del Ramos? It's the son of Wendell. Huh? Who? And? Wendell Ramos. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is he a? He's the only that? Del I know. Yeah. Monsor del Rosario. Del Curry. Hindi po yun. Because other Dells are their last names. It has to be the first name. Del Cruz, maganyan. That's right. Oh, oh. Hindi po. Teka lang ang Del. Okay, Del. Honestly, are you the most famous Del in the country? Yeah. Yes. Del Amar? No, no, no. For sure. Del. Del. Oh, Del? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. I don't think there's a lot of girls named Del. Fair enough. Yeah. Like yeah, the uh, next yeah. to the computer, you're. I want. I want to be named Michelle. I want to be named Michelle Stephanie, a girly <laughs> name. But no, I had to live. She's if in, I'm really sorry about this because this is character building. Yeah. <laughs> it, give your child a very, very rare, ugly name and see how she pushes through her life. <laughs> with it. No, but, you so, but you've never lived a Jose life. This is the worst life ever. Jose, yeah. I really Jose? like the name Jose. Jose. I love the I name don't Jose. Like, I, I, Jose I, hate Jose. My, Jose I hate strong. my Jose so much. I'm gonna name my child Jose. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what's gonna happen. Wow. The fourth. <laughs> but Del, oh. if you had a like a super common name, you think you'd have this level of um, infamy? Ano mayon? Because I think that adds in. Na parang walang ibang ikaw. So when someone says Delamar, oh, it's ito. you, Matic. Right? Ako agad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Huh? Um, I think it helped. I think that, I, you know, I did start on radio with many different names. Oh, please, share one. Right. I would love to hear so. this. I don't know this story. Well, I, don't I know was this named you. Olivia. Olivia. Oh, wow. When I, Olivia, and it was like all female, and we were all like sexy girls. Yeah. At least in voice, okay? Yeah. But, <laughs> and then I didn't like that very much, because I had to be somebody and yeah, sexy yeah. is not the the mold I come out of. So then I had oh god, don't Tinker Dell. Tinker oh, Dell, oh, no, that's back in the day. <laughs> what? No, no, that's back in the day. No, you guys don't know this, you young kids. But back in the day when we were DJs, you had to. It's not just a name. It had to be a something, right? Yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. 
I, I always kind of go back to John Lemon, who was on our station, or like even diba, James. Uh, I do. Mm-hmm. I do is James Bang. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it has James to be Bang. Yeah, James uh-huh. Bang, diba? There was Ted, a play on James Bond. Yeah, Ted Bear. <laughs> there was right. Dick Reese, diba? <laughs> Which, so when you think about these really kind of crazy radio names, Tinker Dell does even not like shock Nicole me. Liala, right? Yeah. Mm. Right, right. Yeah. But that's a little bit right. more witty. Tinker Dell is uh, medyo, yeah, medyo Tinker Dell. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry, sorry I'm, to third, go that. I'm a third year college kasi ako noon. Uh-uh. <laughs> Pero this d- decision ko yun eh. Sabi ko, I think I'll name myself Tinker Dell. Oh my God. <laughs> but it did stand out. You know, it, stand, it stood out because everybody else was named normal. Yeah. And the abnormal girl got a really abnormal name. It's 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 a it's an aberration. Delamar is not a name. It's not. I made a name out of it. Yeah. Right. I, 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 it's a good name. But I think yeah, I think you might be the most famous Del in the country. So sorry Del Ramos, right, Dora? I think it was the one who takes yeah. the, Do you the crush this after Del Ramos. One. No, no, he's <laughs> my Ramos. he's my pseudo pa nephew na siya. Oh, okay. Wow. Well, the, the basketball world calls Rani Del Kuya Del. Mm. Kuya Del. So. Rani Del Ocampo. Ooh, Kuya Del. Oh. It's Rani Del. Rani Del is Major. That's a gilas boy right now. there. Oh, sorry, Del. Oh, sorry, Del. Oh, that's rough. That is rough. You got an arm wrestle for the for supremacy no. here for Del Supremacy. We'll give him my crown. <laughs> <laughs> we got to take a are break. You, we wait, take a break. What? what about your name? Mo? Mo? I, you got to cover it. I, You're, are you the winner? I, I, I think I think so because what's what's been happening recently in social media is when you want to say pi to somebody, <laughs> you, you use pictures of certain famous people. So I've uh, seen yeah. my name a lot yeah, recently right. with Ina Raimundo at the end and a, and, and a tang, uh, you know, tang drink. <laughs> yes. And then. Uh-huh. You'll hear, you'll see like Winnie the Pooh plus and a then tang, you and then Ina Raimundo then, then ako you. and then whoever they're targeting. Yeah. The <laughs> yeah. So, You're a meme. Yeah. You're Usually a meme. it's Mocha or one of yeah or one of those kind of people. So you'll see yeah Winnie the Pooh. There's a tang drink. Ina Raimundo, Mo ako, and then usually like <laughs> Mocha. <laughs> or like Harry or something. At the end of that. Yeah, Harry Roque. Well, what are those guys? We got to go. Take a break. When we come back, we have more of the show. Hey, Delamar is uh, here with us. Guest co-host. They should be here also tomorrow. Mikey's here. Dora's here. Susie's here. What a group. More of us after this. Don't go away. All right. Welcome back to the show. Uh, we are here. Delamar is joining us today. Uh, Susie, of course, Dora, and Mikey. Casey will be back next week for those who are looking for Casey. Oh, another former enemy of the show. Oh, with my. us as well. Oh, it should be fun. <laughs> wow. Look at all this. This is just love. Love, everyone. It's kumbaya. Love. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that it's love <laughs> yet. <laughs> yet, <laughs> diba? Uh, uh, love. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Curiosity, I think, is the mo- <laughs> the most positive. You know, I really couldn't sleep last night, guys. I couldn't sleep. Why? Excited? Sle- Anxiety? Scared uh, of what you? Is it? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. no. More scared. probably being back on radio, right? I mean, it's been yeah, a like a bit. oh gosh, that part of my brain long. has already. I mean, you did the mother show. Five years, dude. Yeah, but mother show is different. the The morning show is a different animal altogether. Okay, tell so I, I have a question. So, but it's not morning, right? It's afternoon. So I, this is finally I have somebody who can relate to my 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 kind of daily routine. We have to mm. pretend in your mind. Does it feel like Manila morning, even though it's five p.m. You're part of the world. In the room that I'm in, yeah, kind of. Really? This okay, is, gotcha. Yeah, I have lights that look like the stations, the walls, the color, everything. Yeah, yeah. Ako, oh, minsan pajamas, coffee. Na ba sa coffee ako, pajamas. Para feeling ko talaga umaga, but it's really like, yeah, 4 p.m. <laughs> no, like, I had to take a shower before the show because yep. it, didn't, it didn't feel right. I always did the show, Shambra, I'm a creature of habits. So I was like, something feels off. I, I need to take a shower. <laughs> not Probably not something I should share with you guys. But honestly, <laughs> I was very, <laughs> I was very n- nervous about myself. Like, what am I, what do I have to say? I'm not, I don't know what to say. So. Yeah. Well, I mean, again, I, I think I, I could relate. I took a bath at 2.30 p.m. in preparation for this 3.30 p.m. Oh. my part of the world uh, show. So everything you're saying, that's that's the life I live here every single day, trying to simulate a morning mindset because we do a morning show. For many of you who might not know, Delamar is actually not in Manila. She is in Utah, hence we were talking about the jazz a little while ago. <laughs> and uh, the, the marvels of technology gets to put all of us here together as if we we're in the same room, even during COVID time, which is really, really kind of cool. Now, 
Now, Del, I, what I love also about you here being on the show and having Mikey on the show and Dora on the show and, you know, Susie and all that stuff is we really represent just a kind of a variety of ages and maybe generations to, to even. I don't want to make this sound like super mega old, but it's true. Dora... D- Dora, Dora, <laughs> I think Dora knows Delamar from you know, but the Morning Rush. Yeah, but but there are little little things that he didn't get that everybody else gets because he's really young. Uh, I think what were you saying the other day, Dora? You're like, oh God, yeah, I love the Delamar and and Chito. They're the yeah. best. You know? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's it's got the years wrong. old. What do you got to do, right? <laughs> you're 25. Yes. Wait, I'm 25. Dora, you're 25. Yeah. Dora be oh. a baby. I'm the Bensaw. Oh my gosh, I can't imagine. When I was 25, I was like three years into radio. I had no idea what I was doing. I don't know why they gave me the job. <laughs> in, fact, in fact, you started, yeah, Tinkerdell, Tinkerdell, you started when he wasn't even born yet. So, I mean, oh, when you oh. think about it, right? It's so, wh- when were you born? I can't do the math. 95. M- Mo tried to do this. You know, he tried to do this seven times eight. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I almost, I all, if I were a little bit more comfortable with him, I would have, you know, cussed him out. Because right, right. that's not some, something you ask me. <laughs> so bubble in math. Anyway, when were you born? 95. What's your year? 95. Oh my yeah. gosh. Yeah, that's right, that's right. when I started the morning show. Wow. Really? Oh, wow. On RX? Yes. Oh. Yep. Yep. Well, it was 1995. Can you believe that? Oh, wow. This is full circle. Like, yeah, so I'm and, looking and, and at and Nora, and I'm, I'm if if my career on radio had been a human being, it would be like well, yeah. you, yeah. your age, dude. Yeah, wow, <laughs> I could be your mother. But there's there's a lot to learn here from these young people, and I think sometimes people of our age can easily get mad at a 25 year old just because maybe sometimes there's a generation gap when it comes to certain topics and then just the kind of way society works. Like I, I want to know, Dell, what's your woke level? As as a person, I mean, are you willing to share how old you are? Because again, maybe eight times seven is also not something you ask. But maybe also an age is not something you ask. You know, how old are you? I, I, I told, I'm forty seven. Forty seven. Okay, so you're yeah. you're twenty two years. That's math. O- older than Dora, <laughs> and okay. you're seventeen. I can years. do that math. That's easy. All right, well, seventeen <laughs> years older than Mikey here. So uh-huh. with. What's your woke level? I mean, I know you're very, you know, you're on Twitter. You're, you're on Instagram. You know what that is. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. You're brave, you to, are, so. woman with you to opinions. Yeah, I do mm-hmm. have my opinions. I just think that wokeness, and so I don't even know if we're talking about the same wokeness. Yeah, okay, well, that's true. Because I get to the U.S., and it's a different animal altogether. There are wokeness here. But in general, I think wokeness, I don't have a problem with the actual being woke yeah. i have a problem with people who ride on the wokeness bandwagon and feel like they understand what they're talking about mm, dora. Mm-hmm. because <laughs> hey uh, <laughs> be be fair, I, don't, I don't know dora knows yeah, what he's dora, talking dora. about you all the time <gasps> okay so so that's different because i i know a lot of people who just <laughs> go absorb things from celebrities Mm-hmm. Don't bother yeah. to think anything first. Like, right. is this true? Right. Fact check. Where is this woman coming from or this man, whatever? Oh, he's talking about this. So when they come at me with wokeness ideas and you can just tell they don't know anything about what they're talking about, it it pisses me off big time. Uh, yeah, I understand that. And, and what, yeah, what, what's kind hard. of... I know Mikey, we've been teasing Mikey all week long, even the week, uh, was <laughs> every, the first week you were day. here, about, and it's just about every day, <laughs> that Mikey's a young guy, but he's got a really kind of old school male, <laughs> alpha male personality oh that can come off as against the, the, the movement, yeah. right? And oh, I, really? I'm just saying, yeah. I, that, yeah. 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 I, think, I think it's not as bad. Like, I, I, I know Dora... It rubs Dora a little bit the wrong way, but not in the sense that I think Dora actually dislikes him you know, yeah. inside. But you can see. Give me, a, give me an example. I want to. I want to. I want to feel this. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get to that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna get to that. Okay, just you know, one fine, issue. Fine. Let's, let's get one. Dora, well, give me, give me, give me the microaggression. Oh no, here we go. I'll, I'll, I'll tell the story. So, um, Mikey's current girlfriend is you, you know has only dated females prior to mm-hmm. him has only dated females mm-hmm. so yesterday he's like yeah well you know my girlfriend now ako yung first boyfriend niya lahat ng ex niya puro, puro babae so you know syempre baka face yun at uh, ako you know <laughs> is, is really the thing and and you see Dora's face just Dora's like <laughs> seizuring yep. you know anything because how dare you call 
her past a phase because mm-hmm. she hasn't dated any guys. Well, and and you know, to me, I didn't, I didn't catch up on that because maybe again, I'm not as woke as Dora, or maybe I come from a, a, a time where that's that's kind of I want to say acceptable, but you know, it's it's much ado about nothing, and. And, and, and Doris, you're having an aneurysm every time he says something like that. No, so, I, 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 the, the story I got shocked about, yung, two days ago, I think, we were talking about the famous influencer. And then Mikey says, parang may vibes siya, no? And then I was like, Sino nga ba to? Sino nga ba to? Ah, si ano? Yeah. <laughs> Stop. Parang may vibes siya, no? So I go, what? What do you mean parang may vibes siya? And then, because you're talking oh. about the girlfriend, right? Dara has like zero patience for Mike. I have zero None. patience for Mike. Zero. I, I was thinking about it on the way home about yung, when I said the uh, phase. Yeah. I actually yeah. I actually hear that from some some girls, de ba? Parang, oh, I just went through. I actually heard that from them, Dini. So parang, that's where I got it. <laughs> and also, it's not that. It's like, wal wal. It's not my fault. Like, it's I theirs. also had a phase of. <laughs> of can, can I, no. I think it's in general, Wait, not it, specifically it, that. <laughs> Uh uh-uh. uh, yeah. but it also it's also okay. If if you're a teenager trying to explore your sexuality, there are phases. Yeah. But if you're a bisexual at age twenty something and you've dated many women, mm-hmm. and now you're attracted to a guy, that could just make you a bisexual. So a bisexual dating previously women and then a man, that's not a phase. That's yeah. being no, bisexual. She's she's young, right? So she's young. She's not on her twenty yeah. something. <laughs> She's, she's, 20, she's 20. 19. No, but still. Oh, okay. She's 20. I love how Del <laughs> right. had the patience to explain yeah, this. Yeah, right? And the other day, we were just like judging him <laughs> and saying, Bobo! <laughs> <laughs> See, old, school Mikey? Eh. old school eh. <laughs> I was trying to defend Mikey I was saying I think he's old school I, I don't take too much offense to yeah. it and um, and I think that's what this I think that what this dynamic of, of us here on the show through as as, you know, as we get through episodes and episodes and episodes and weeks and weeks and weeks we're going to be able to share some of that and even maybe kind of make that right timpla of what's <laughs> offensive and what's not so bad and what can we still be funny about and what we should never do again I mean let, let's right. let's talk about I mean, here, well, what's a very top, uh, typical topic? No, of this? but 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 Dora was also just voicing because what what Dora is getting angry about, getting triggered with, is that a lot of people think that it's it's just a point to get to somewhere. When really, no, that's you. That's your sexuality already, right? right? Yeah. Do I understand you, Dora? Yes. So I understand where. Um, I don't even know what to what what pr- pronoun am I supposed to use? Oh, or, do you okay. identify as he? He, he, yeah. he, she, he, she. Anything is Him fine. Is fine yeah. So that that okay. So that part that part is very hard for me, and it's not because I don't I don't believe that you should you should definitely decide your life, but if you can't expect other people who haven't lived your life to immediately. Yeah. Just understand the right, world, right, right? Right. That that's the part that I think needs to be bridged. And Mikey being here gives. <laughs> did you think that Mikey was being obnoxious by saying that, Dora? No, I think just he was just being him. Yeah, just uninformed. That's rude. Oh, oh, I'm not that I know because I'm I'm in the middle. I'm in the middle. Yeah. I I understand the wokeness. I get it. But there's also like an expectation of the woke people, of people who don't live your life to understand every single step you've been through. Right. They can't. They they haven't gone through what you've gone through. And that's why you should be just as patient with the straights. And I, I once talked to, I had a chance to talk to um, a transgender and I asked, I'm so sorry because I don't know what to say. And it's come to a point where I don't even know. I don't even want to talk to anybody whom I feel would have a different pronoun because I don't know what to call him, right, her, she, right. they, be. Yeah. But then it ends up, I don't talk to them. Where's the, where's, where's the good in that? Because you're so scared yeah. to yeah. offend. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, tako, tako eh. Kasi Twitter will come for you and yeah. God knows they've already crucified me many times. They've killed me many really? times like, on Twitter. When was like, the, the wildest kill? <laughs> Uh, I would say any anything Duterte. Oh, anything, um, right. anything, a beer. Um, <laughs> 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 I 
Hey, hey, you, you, hey, uh, you sit right in on the show. Here, sit down. I don't sit in very, ano eh. Gusto ko yung, ano, Amazona vibe ni Nitin when it comes to these things. I mean, it's just hard. It's hard to live and talk in this world when everybody's just trying... So quick, so quick to crucify someone mm-hmm. for just not knowing. Sometimes oh, okay, it's can, not can I bring up? A, can, let me bring up an example here. How, mm-hmm. how do we feel about the qualifiers? I, I don't even know if that's the right term because, again, uh, Dora, you're you're the most woke of us, and then Susie's probably right up there as well. But when we say female soldier, female basketball player, yeah. male nurse, uh, that that has been kind of a bit of a uh, of a topic about recently. That no need to call them yeah. by the gender yeah. and then what they do as a as a profession. I have no problem with this. Like I get zero. I feel zero ickiness. I I don't understand why people make a big deal out of it. Am I am I am I mikeying this or or, <laughs> yeah, or, yeah. or, or is same. Del right? Like hey, give Mo some time to yeah, the bad Mike like yeah, female police yeah. officer. So what? She's, she's a female. Like who cares? We, here in the U.S., um, Del, we're very proud of having what female vice president. Like it's a really, really big yeah. deal. In it's the NBA, a, they, it's a big deal. You say it with pride, right? In the NBA, they you say, say with pride. They, they're proud that they have female referees. So. Right, yeah. Mm-hmm. And, yeah. And yet, right, right. yet sometimes you'll say, oh, lady, lady basketball player. Oh, why do you got to be a lady? <laughs> why not? <laughs> it's a good thing. We mean it in a yeah. good way. Yeah. Uh, I think How because it's the, the, the more and, common jobs. Yeah. Engineers. Female lawyer, female lawyers. doctor, female. Yeah, why is there yeah. a need to declare? What about Susie? Because I'm sure you've been introduced as lady, the female jock, uh, yeah. lady DJ. Have, have, have you ever been called that? Yeah. Um, and always, do you, did you mind it? Parang, um, no, when maybe when I was starting, I mean, I just figured, okay, eh, ganun eh, di ba? I mean, they have to differentiate. And then, I thought, oh, nga, bakit kailangan? And then, pati na lang, okay, host, DJ, di ba? Parang, tsaka hmm. I always get, ay, alam mo, magaling kang DJ for a girl, ah. Doon ako naiinis. Oh, yun na kakainis. I can see where that might be a little bit more of, again, uh, Doris, microaggression. But I still don't, if we if we go to the female blank or male nurse or whatever, I, I really don't, I think we should calm down about that. Uh, I think that identifier or that qualifier or whatever is a good thing. In fact, you... Some, some, I don't know, Susie, you're somewhat of a feminist, right? You guys will wear a t-shirt. <laughs> You'll wear a t-shirt. <laughs> girl power. Girl boss. Diba? There are guys out there that put girl dad. That's a very mm-hmm. common t-shirt right now that many proud fathers mm-hmm. wear. I have no problem with this, yet it's very anti-woke. So, Dora, um, I don't correct think, me. I don't think it's super anti-woke. When you mean it in a good way. Pero kasi when we use it in professions that um, parang we assume na females sorry females are less capable of doing the job yeah. kaya we have to indicate na female mm-hmm. engineer parang because, may konting disclaimer eh. yeah Mm-mm. na parang oh either, either that or the opposite either that or the opposite right. kasi yeah. in engineering for example since it's a male dominated um, industry or profession when you say you're a female it also means you're you're kind of you rose above yeah. the Swag. challenges right. that Swag. most. May mga ganon pero for for me, ha, I, I think I I don't think you should say female DJ, male, whatever, if it's not pertinent to the issue. Yeah. So let's just say I'm saying you know, if I'm saying you know my doctor told me I need, I need to take whatever blah blah. blah. I could say that without saying my female doctor said I should, because what what's the point? Yeah. Whether he's male or she's female has nothing to do with, with what my doctor yeah. was telling me. Mm-hmm. Oh, so you can definitely say female whatever if it's pertinent to it. Gosh, how do I feel about that? Okay, um, when I when people ask me, say, hey, who's on the show right now? I go, oh, well, you know, you know, Susie. Susie and I have been together for years, man. She's like, love Susie. I don't go Susie female DJ, right? I say Susie because you're a recognizable name, proper noun, right? Um, mm-hmm. And then I'll go Mikey, the basketball player, Mikey Reyes, because it helps kind of identify, identify maybe for people who, oh, I know that guy. And then when I go, Dora, sorry, Dora, I go, that's Dora. He's a gay guy on the show. <laughs> 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 I mean it. Adds nothing. Oh, I mean it. Like an in, identifier? You know? I, I mean it in... Just so you know, we're rangy. The mix. Okay. Yeah, we're rangy. It's a good thing. He's 
But but in, in the, like Bugsy Mikey, when you say oh he's a basketball player, so andam andam yung manang pwedeng sabihin he's an athlete, he knows sports, ganyan. Pero when you say oh he's a gay guy, like there's nothing you can conclude. I mean it in I mean it in diversity. Ah yeah. For for diversity, I mean it in range. I think I think people would go. He might be the fun one of the group, yeah. true, true. In that, in only a positive perspective. Like no, I don't mean he's the gay guy. Oh, it's 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 really the good the good <laughs> the things, things about it, right? <laughs> I know. No, because diba, diba, in 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 my sitcoms, and I was talking to R- R- Ramon uh, Bautista about this. Diba, you there's two comedians in a sitcom, right? There's the guy who is uh, diba, the one cracking the jokes, and then the right. other comedian is yung kumakain ng tae. It's mm. and you don't want to be as a comedian the funny guy. Na kumakain ng tae, diba? That's right. the right. thing. Right. I'm, I'm, I'm uh-huh. the joke. That, yeah, pa, yeah, like that. Uh-huh. I, I, I don't mean it in that way when I say. Oh, that's the gay guy on the show. I don't mean it as ito yung kumakayan na tayo sa, sa programa natin. It, it, that's not yeah. the context, right? I mean it proudly. I think it's that so context. So I, I, I that forgot word. where we are. Context. No, no? Uh, yeah, context. But if, if I were Dora, this is how I would feel. And I'm not, I'm, I don't wish to put m- words into your mouth, but I'm just thinking, well, why can't I just be the guy? And so whatever he says, we have to judge it as it comes out. Not that because he's gay. Because then, then everyone has to be identified as whatever. Just say, um, Dora, he's a 25-year-old. So I, I was a woke guy. Okay, yeah. I, 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 was watching, I was watching the Blackpink uh, documentary on Netflix, if you haven't seen it. Um, I want to see. I want to watch that. Okay, I, I love Blackpink, right? And the producer was, I think he took a little bit of offense, maybe would be, I, I don't know if offense is a strong word, but he said, why are we called K-pop? Why not just pop? Like, is it because we speak mm. Korean? We don't go English pop. Why is it? Why is K-pop Korean pop? Can't it just be pop? And I sit there and I'm like, God, I can't disagree more because it helps identify what yeah. sound we're going to expect, yeah. what the style we're going to expect, and that it's not just K-pop that has K-pop in it. It was OPM. It's just Filipino right there. It's not just music. It's not our music. It's we put Filipino music in there. We know British or French hip hop. We know what to expect. Accent. Language, there's an, it comes yeah. with a preconditioned style, which might be innately wrong, but it helps us identify and appreciate it. So he's he's like, oh, I don't like this whole K-pop, K-pop thing. I just want us to be pop. Well, I mean, that there are sports leagues that are named entirely after the country or the people that play them. This is the world we're living in in 2021. That's why I hate the world right now. <laughs> That's why I'm in Utah. Like, I, you can't, I mean, <laughs> no, I'm sorry because I can't talk about the things we need to talk about. I mean, other things because we're just so caught up in the other stuff. Yeah. Like, true. for example, I would say the reason why it has to be K-pop is the more popular, the dominant is American pop. Let's right. face it. That's right. how it is. Yeah. So you, as a newcomer, you have to identify yourself. It would be like mga Pinoy dyan sa Pilipinas. Pag umuwi ka, pero dito ka na nakatira, tawag nila sa'yo balikbayan. Right. It's just like, okay, kami yung status quo, ikaw yung papasok sa group. That's why we identify. That's why you say K-pop. Because it's a different kind of pop. And most of them, di ba, hindi in English. Some of them, yeah. the Filipinos I know, right. actually learn uh, right, right, Korean to right. be able to sing. So you do kind of need it. And why do we always assume that it's malevolent? Exactly. Why, does it, mm-hmm. why exactly. do we have to assume that it's malevolent? It's malevolent? When I came in and they asked me, oh, this, there's this girl DJ, she's new. You know what? The truth is, I'm going to go It's okay. You can. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. F word na. I know, but I don't know. Because I don't know. Because the president is going to shit on TV. So, we can shit on TV. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of FDN, but there are standards. We have restraint. We don't have PPI. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, or if I say, yeah, or if I say, who is here? But nothing outright. Not like our leader. But anyway, sorry, you as you were. I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> no, but I'm just, this is the world and it's kind of like, oh yeah, when I was new, you know, I know a lot of success stories where the women, for example, the Dolly Parton documentary, everybody told her, look, you're a girl. How can you be a country singer? Right? Everybody was this, was just dismissing her as this dumb blonde. Yeah. Like it's a category. Right. Nobody knew that this girl is so smart. 
and talented. So anyway, she did whatever. And she just thought, you know, it's not my problem if they want to label me. I'm just going to do what I want to do. And if I'm good enough, you're going to adjust your language to me. But right now, I just got to do what I got to do. Yeah. Yeah, so I, I think I, that's what I like. I love the that's challenge. I like. Yeah, I love if somebody's going to kind of marginalize you to take it as a challenge instead of getting defensive or again True. kind of a, attack because of your being defensive. So what's going on right now, right? I mean, you've seen this uh, on the news, many of you, right? This whole Chinese was it this Chinese sitcom or or whatever TV show that did the whole "You Look Like a Filipino Maid" and oh of no, I didn't we got see this. Upset. Oh yeah, I saw that too. Okay, so they yeah Ooh, they recently they recently apologized. Oh, gosh, hold on, let me let me try to find it here real quick. Um, this is, this is a Chinese streaming platform has apologized amid the backlash of the mention of Filipino Maid in one of its drama series. Uh, the name of the show is "Make My Heart Smile," I believe. And there was a scene where one of the female characters, sorry, female characters, right? I got it, right? Uh, one of the female characters walks, comes into like, I guess the room. She's dressed, uh, she's picking out clothing at a clothing store and she puts on this, what looks like it could be a duster. And the guy's like, you look like a Filipino maid. He says that in Chinese. Mm. Um, and of course, we've crossed this bridge many times here as a country, as a people, where we are going to take massive offense to this. Mm -mm. And... It has not. It's not a 2021 thing, Dora. Th we've been talking about this on the radio since you were born. We get we get upset about this. Yeah. Are we too sensitive? Do we lack a sense of humor as a country, as a people? What's the? Let me let me start with Dell, since you know Del, we, we haven't had you on the show here before. And we've talked about this, I think, a little bit in in the past. What, what's wrong with us? Are we just crybabies, or that was really really offensive? I think both are correct, and, and this is why a lot of people can't understand opposing concepts existing at the same time. It's true that you can't generalize uh, a nation just because all you've ever encountered from them are maids. We can, as tayo Pinoy, dapat natin tanggapin yon, our biggest, one of our biggest Domestic exports. Health, yeah. Like, yeah, is, is the services of domestic helpers. And I don't know why we want to dismiss that because that's, we need to acknowledge that it is. Right. Now, the right. problem is there are also Filipino doctors and they're big in the U.S. as well. And nurses, But right? outnumbered siya ng, and yeah, nurses, nurses, correct. Dominant, that's right. Dominant, the dominant one. Right. So I, I think on the one hand, it needs to be said just for our nation, just to sell, to tell people that. Na parang, you know, lahat ng mga nakikita nyo, hindi, they don't speak of all Filipinos. There are 130 million of us. Oh, hindi, 109? We're like, yeah, well, yeah. I mean, 109 one, million yeah, of us? 110 in that range, maybe, yeah. So you, you don't know, you're only seeing a little bit of the Filipinos. You can't generalize that everybody's a household help. But can't I easily go as a household help be offended by your offense? About, like... Ew, that, Yon, I, I was about really, to say, yeah, what's really, wrong with that? Yeah, what's wrong? So what? So what? I look like Filipino maid. What's wrong with that? I'm a Filipino maid. Well, all of yes. a sudden, about, it, we can get into that yep. conversation. It's just a big yeah. circle and spiral of just mm, yep, everyone yeah. getting so goddamn offensive. Can we just kind of pull the plug and everybody shut up? There was also Don't this, get offended. Th this Let's thing on, humor. on Twitter where menong amo and then na huling yada on nakikapag chakchakan yung maid nila sa driver nila. Right, and then he she shared this on Twitter, la 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 la, and everyone took offense to it. So, yeah, that's wrong, ganyan. But the maid herself thought it was funny, but everyone else um, thought it was yeah. offensive. Mm -hmm. So, where is so? Yeah, so we need to do we need to pull back. Are we gonna, we need to pull back a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, because it's an okay, overcorrection. I, I, yeah, I have I have a. So I'm, di ba nga, I'm hosting a new show on Mix, and I'm writing a few intros, right? I want to run an intro to you, and I want I want you to tell me if it's offensive. Oh, so Mikey, yeah, see, Mikey, oh, I, I want like Mikey's this. opinion about this okay. first. Oh, okay. oh, good one, Mikey. Good you're, one. You're, you're, you're you're on deck. All right, let's okay. hear this. Go ahead. Okay, Go ahead, Dora. I'm gonna say, hi, I'm Dora, and my mother taught me to really stick to my Filipino roots. So. Uh, naturally, my first were my first words were, um, sir, check lang po tayo ng BP. <laughs> no, no, didn't get the joke. Oh no, I, I got the <laughs> joke. I got, it. I got it. I got the joke. I think it's a little bit of an international joke more oh. than it is a local joke since it's a mix. Wait, you think it's offensive? Are you asking? No, cannot be offensive. I'm, I'm, it's uh, offensive. I guess some might think na I'm generalizing Filipinos as nurses or as you know. No. Oh, so so how is it? Okay. So how is it that you feel like that might be wrong?
but we put Jokoy on. on yeah. Yeah. Go, Jokoy! Stereotype, greatest, stereotype. Greatest ever <laughs> comedian, Filipino. Jordan Clarkson ng Pilipinas. Ito. <laughs> and yet, he, that's his joke. Yeah. I mean, not that you took it, but yeah. you get that's his punchline. That's, that, that's the line. So, yeah. like, oh, but we applauded. Like, but but why do they applaud it? Because it's true. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. So, so, I think so it's really who... It's, it's it's not it's not the line per se so much as it is the uh, the person who's giving it. By the way, we had calls and sorry, I, I we, we've been talking. We f- forget to pick these up. Eight six three one zero eight nine nine is our phone number. If you want to jump in on this, because obviously this is a topic that you know the world discusses. Uh, so if we didn't answer, I apologize. Please call us back. We'll get to you. Um, so yeah, maybe not the line, but just who's delivering it. Mikey, yeah. you say that line, you get in trouble. Joko oh. says that line, he sells out. Yeah. It's 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 kind of bit. I'm not offended. I'm not offended. Uh, yeah. Dora at all. I'm not offended. Yeah, I don't even know. I'm not offended. 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 That's the problem. That's the problem. The problem is that I'm not offended. 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 I'm not Oh God! Okay, this is a transphobic joke. This is the dis- uh, disclaimer. Wait, uh, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Dora, is it a transphobic joke? Because I don't know. You've said that about eight times. <laughs> Let's just hear it. Okay. Yeah. Let's hear it. Ready? Okay. Hi, I'm Dora. I'm the girl your mom warned you about because my dick's bigger than yours. Oh. Hey, you guys, welcome to Mix and Match. Can you I say love that? It. No, on mix? love it, love it, love it. I love oh, it. they gave me Hilarious. complete freedom on Mix. Oh. Okay, love, so this is just online. It. It's not no. gonna appear on. Um, it's our. It's a live stream on Kumu. Okay, so it's not and gonna... then it's edited on Mix. Okay, yeah. so they're gonna take okay, that so, part well, out. Okay, so okay, your 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 delivery is a little too quick, right? But I think the joke itself is funny. That that's funny. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Feeling ko, feeling ko Dora, kailangan mo. No, no, I'm not worried about that. It's the comic timing. Yeah, your uh, your delivery is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. I, I, I'm, just very, I'm just very like <laughs> cold and dry when I do my jokes. I'm not like you know. You're you're not you're not like you're not okay. We got a caller. We'll, we'll take you. Uh, caller, good morning. While while we're waiting for a caller to get on, you're not your 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 delivery's Frozen. flatline. Yeah, you gotta you yeah. gotta kind of hey everyone. It is it 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 it. So my dick is massive compared to your small Filipino yeah. dick. Good morning. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Who's this? Um, I guess. Hello. Hello. I'm calling to, I guess, provide some um, perspective on as to why certain languages can be malevolent. Okay. Okay, let's we'll start with your name first, just so oh, we get, we get that out Michael. of the way. It's just kind of Michael. Hey, Michael. What's going Hello. on? Hello. <clears throat> okay, so I think um, the characteristic of language being malevolent stems from the fact that um, certain people, specifically the marginalized ones who were trying to protect from these languages, um, tend to get boxed in with a... With a um, with the misconceptions, I guess we could say, and and um, I guess a negative aspect of woke language also is is treating language as, vi- as violence. But yeah, the malevolent nature comes from the fact that um, since people keep hearing these negative perceptions or misconceptions rather, um, then they get stuck inside the box that that the language puts them in. I guess that makes. I hope that makes sense. Can you kill that lamo? Absolutely not. The lamo. You puma pass up the blue light. Michael, I have no idea what he said. anybody anybody understand what he said? Can, can somebody yeah. translate? Not that uh, I can't understand the words he's using. I just don't understand the collection of words he's using. <laughs> it's like no, he's he pre- just he was saying the language of seven. Being- yeah. Okay. Go ahead. He, yeah, he I was making the thesaurus saying yeah. that. Uh, well, that if, it kind of. Yeah. Anyways, I think sorry, what he's don't. saying is, if language is used to marginalize the marginalized already, and so when we keep saying these words, like, like you said, "sabi nyo kanina sayang," de ba? Yung mga ganon. He well, it's a perspective where you use language to marginalize people and to keep them down or in their box. 
and keep them there. Uh, but but isn't, isn't that where motive comes in? And I know it's hard to be clear what everyone's motive is when they say a line. Yep. Wait, wait, is, is Dora here? Dora, where, where yeah, are you? Yeah, I'm here, I'm here. Where no, no, are you? not Michael. Your name's not Dora. Uh, but, oh, oh. Thanks, Michael. Have you day. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, no. And we'll put you on hold for a sec. Maybe we'll use you still. But earlier, my wife off air came onto the screen here because she's a big Delamar fan, so she wanted to say hi to Delamar. And she was telling uh, you guys about a instructor that she rides her Peloton bike in, and she loves this guy, and he's gay, and he's good looking, and he's super, super buff, like yeah. flamboyant, yeah, oh, so really fit. Oh, and my wife did the whole, it's a young, right? Now, that you guys would take such massive offense to that, Dora. I, I could see like your eyeballs like sweating. <laughs> but what my wife means is sayang for me. Yeah. yeah. Right? Yeah. Not sayang in general. Na, yep. Sayang siya. Yeah. Bakla siya. Uh, sayang bakla siya kasi I can't get a piece of that now. Yeah. Right? And Mo right. not being offended. This. Well, I'm taking the Mikey rattle is, this one, whatever. is it the same as when people call basketball players like Engot? Is it the same? Like, yeah. Oh, they can say Engot talaga yun. Sometimes. Uh, <laughs> uy, Mikey, <laughs> when you're... No, no, no. Sometimes I guess that. Na parang, uy, may sense ka pala kausap. Kasi akala ko, typical. Uh-uh. Uh-huh. Like, well, we go against salita. stereotype. Uh, oh. I don't get offended. Yeah, yung, kasi the, the stereotype is you're, you're, yeah. you're good at sports, you must be that's dumb, it. right? Yeah. But we already know that's not true, even with beautiful women. The most beautiful women in Hollywood, some of them are Mensa members. So yeah. Natalie yeah. Portman yeah. is Portman. from Harvard, Portman is right? Portman, a... uh, Mira Servino, Sharon Stone. Right. Right. These done. women are... What? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> Didn't you watch the documentary about Paris yeah. She's Mensa? apparently smart. Yeah, she's super smart. Yeah. No, no, but is it she Mensa? No, I don't it's think she's no, no, no. Mensa, but she's smart. Yeah. Oh, so so oh, I mean, I'm sure that they mm. also feel bad when you know people call them just beautiful. But did you? But, but is it sort of we have more than say? Okay, in Mikey's sense, the guy can say baller. Oh, baller. Oh, you know, hang out. Oh, you, you get that a lot. But listen, who are the ballers that are kind of out there in circulation? Um, that are trying to change that stigma. Chris. Or who are the athletes? Okay, well, let's write it down. Okay, what are you, you going to say? Chris Chu. Chris Chu. Okay, Chris Chu. Chris Chu probably more a nice guy than a guy who's out there trying to change the world about how we think athletes oh. are uh, intelligent. Like, wise. He's more like, I'm not going to be Baba Ero, I'm not going to be kind of that. Yeah, but more of the in nice terms of smart, in terms of smart I don't know if... Jet Manuel is one. Okay, right. All right, so... I don't know that guy, but I do know <laughs> Pacquiao. <laughs> I do know, <laughs> I know, I know, I know Pacquiao, who is probably going to be our president. Looks like a dumbass, but that's what we get. Like our our athletes who are trying to kind of get in, you know, in, in important positions, also aren't the smartest ones. They're just the famous ones, and it's helping us with the narrative that you guys are stupid. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and your stories know. last week helped with that narrative too. No, I'm. That's ah, true. See, yeah. this is where the hatred comes in. Yeah. Nice one, Dora. Where the hatred comes in. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. Maybe that's it. Like we, we I, I, there are smart athletes out there. They're just we, we don't see enough of them. We, we get the dumb ones because the dumb ones are popular. True. Oh, I know. Um, I don't know uh, about that. Uh, um, the volleyball <laughs> you know, player, no, the, sorry, the captain of volleyball no. player, um, UP, right? The woman. Uh, oh, na, Kat na, Kat na, oh, right? oh, the Persona. woman volleyball player. Sino to? Oh, oh. Kat, uh, yeah, Kat versus Kat. Yan, super cum laude. Uh, super cum laude. Super cum laude. Super cum laude. Super duper cum laude. Sorry. Pero lahat ng mga taga UP, are you convinced that pe- uh, everybody in UP is smart? Yes. I've, Until I met Mikey. <laughs> no, I met. Yes, I've absolutely. met a lot of stupid think, people in there are two kind, I think there are two kinds of smart. I think I believe street smart, like, book smart, oh, yeah. smart and book smart. Yeah. Mikey yeah. had a teammate oh. na na cum laude. Yeah, but yeah, like cum laude, mm. but you know, street smart hindi siya nag jeep hindi siya. If you leave him in an island in the middle of wherever, hindi niya kaya bumalik sa UP. That's. Eh, di naman di kasi siya dito lumaki. Okay. All right, let's take a call. 8631. Yeah. 8631098. But to answer your question, Del, real quick before this one, I, yeah, I, I believe that 
the great majority of UP students are intelligent. There are going to be exceptions to every single generalization. Exactly. That's fine. But I'm we're we're, we're working with the broader the, uh, opinion about certain things. Right. Oh, there's always going to be a Natalie Portman. There's always going to be a Georgina Wilson. But mm -hmm. there's going to be a ton, shit ton of them that aren't. You know. Uh, good morning. Hey, hi. Hi. Who's this? Oh, can you turn off your radio, please? I hear your signal light. <laughs> Sir? Hello? Hello? Hey, hi, guys. Good morning. Hi, can you turn off hey, your radio, are you please? Wait, 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 wait. And wait, wait, turn wait, off yeah, your yeah, speakerphone. Not just so, that. The speakerphone, sir. Come on now. You know who you're talking to. Stop that. So, can you signal light? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hello? <laughs> Good morning. Hello? Is better? Hello? You, Perfect. Your, your What's radio your is still on. There's a, There's feedback. It's, it's off. I'm sorry. Okay, there you go. Right. There you go. It's perfect. Good morning. Yeah. All right, right. What's your name? Hi, good morning. This is Aldrich. Aldrich, what's up? Aldrich. Oh, yeah, I, I just want to share something, and I guess it, it comes from the standpoint of, of Mo, that um, yeah. at, at least with my job in my generation, when we identify certain people with certain titles, that uh, it kind of is difficult because I'm coming from a standpoint to either just identify them so that people be aware. Uh, say, example, because I, I train for a living in a corporate, uh, you know, in the cor corporate How do you? setup. And How do you? there's this one trainee who came in <laughs> and, you know, I, I needed to identify her as Muslim just because, you know, there is an upcoming, like, potluck. And I, I want people to be aware that, you know, she does not eat pork. And sure, I, I don't know, mm -hmm. because maybe sometimes that a lot of people would, 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 would be coming off from a different perspective and coming off from a, a different intention. And it's so, so easy to, you know, uh, to, to be misunderstood when we, when I get to refer to these titles or to these certain words with both preferences and all that. Yeah. So, so what are you saying exactly? Uh, uh, yeah, I think, I think, I think he's saying that he had to introduce her as, okay, the new, the trainee, by the way, everyone is Muslim. Like he had to announce it. And because of a certain because reason. she was worried about her her diet and right. again I, this this goes back to what I'm saying about motive right it depends on how you the context the delivery it, it let's just go back to Dora's joke I think the joke on paper is great the delivery is rough right and <laughs> and and you can take that you can take that example in a lot of aspects in life especially when we're actually conversing with another person or introducing in this case the, this girl that you're talking about the context is everything now if you went hey guys uh what's her face is coming in she's muslim and then you start like doing these body movements that are could be mentioned negatively your point is is to kind of negatively imply that muslims are bad for some whatever reason then it's a different problem, right? So context, delivery, all of that stuff means something. And I don't think we should immediately get upset if somebody said a line and disregard what the context is. Yeah. So anyway, thanks for the call. Have a good day. Thanks. Bye. Right. Thank you, guys. Aldrich. Bye. <sighs> right. Wait, we got, uh, we got serious here today. My I know what happened. what happened. I want, I want to like super, super... Quentong kadiri tomorrow? Bukas, quentong kadiri. Quentong kadiri bukas. Now... Quentin Redid is always our nice palate cleanser of a segment here. Anytime we get a little too political or a little too, like, you know, woke or whatever, we'll do Quentin Redid and we'll go actually literally to the Kumahaya Nantai stories. Wait, <laughs> what? You, you said that fast. What, what is it called? Quentin Redid is a segment Quentin we do. Quentin yeah. Redid. Anytime okay. we feel like we're getting too religious or too political or too anything social, whatever, awareness, we'll do a Quentin Redid uh, segment where people call and we have a, we have a, <laughs> We usually have I, like a like no, the regular edition. <laughs> yeah, Susie opened this. You, Susie opened that the other day. Was it no la last week? Friday was it? The the putahe. I was listening right, and right. I was like, oh, wow, that's a, that's another way to open this show. Right. right. <laughs> but I was like, okay, I, I'm wide awake. Okay. It's better than coffee. Multiply that by a hundred with Quento I mean, and and speaking of Susie and KK, right? We've told the story a hundred times, but Del, you know, and oh, Mikey God. may have not heard this. Maybe even Dora. The reason why Quento Kadiri actually exists was Susie was telling a story, got to be seven years ago, when, when we first did our first KK segment, where Susie was saying that her crush was at her house and she had her period, right? But her crush was there. They were in the living room, mm -hmm. you know, <laughs> whatever, just romances in the air. And her dog takes out Susie's pad, her fresh changed pad out of the uh, <laughs> oh, the, the trash can and brings it to her 
Yeah. Brings oh it to her God. and drops it like a stick for for fetch <laughs> in front of boy. Like a gift. And oh we're like, God. yeah. God. Best story all time. It's horrible. <laughs> Tapos alam mo yung wala naman akong kapatid na lalaki. So, akin yun. Yeah. <laughs> Can't blame it on anyone else. That shit is mine. And then, of course, the what dog. What did you do? I can't remember. I think I blocked it out. This was so traumatic. <laughs> <laughs> she starts God. telling the guy her cycle. Ew, who says that? No, no, I finished my <laughs> musical. <laughs> Bantai, get out of here. Uh, or at least, or, or you just look at him, at least I'm safe. <laughs> They said we have about seven days after to, you know. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh, my God. Okay, okay. So we, we need a cuento kadiri to just kind of change the, the mood the here. I apologize. I should have brought this up. Oh, yeah. Because she doesn't look like a kadiri okay. person. All right, All right fine, fine. So fine. we like need okay. to unearth her kadiri story. That's right. Del, even even Mikey doesn't have KKS, right? No, Mikey's Kadiri. Del, because... Mikey! It's surprising. What edition, Tin? Tin, what edition, though? Because we have to give an edition. Wait lang. How about... There's the... Kailangan tumay, walang banyo edition. I want a regular edition from Del. Do you have a gross regular story? Okay. Perfect. I can't... I don't know. Do I? Del, do you still have regla? Oh, oh, naman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, naman. Oy, kung, kung buhok tayo, ageist ka. Ha? <laughs> 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 uh, ageist, how dare you? Okay. Define me as a woman by my monthly menstruation. I'm more than just my endometrium. <laughs> anyway. Okay, I had to, sorry. Oh, ageist. <laughs> It was ages. Oh, I got ages. the joke then. I got that's it. Funny. I got it. Dora, yes, that's how you do it. Dora, that's how you do it. That was great that's the delivery. delivery. I have you to see? take Alex. Yeah, you, got, you got to learn that. You got to learn that. Uh-uh. All right. Back, back <laughs> to <laughs> your... <laughs> dis, back to your discharge. No, I'm sorry. Because <laughs> here's my promise. For as long as I'm doing the show and it comes up... Because I'm not really going to get into that. I'm just going to get into it. Yeah, yeah. No? No, I can do that. No, I can do that. Kadiri? Oh, oh, and I, I have many. Because you're, so eh. you're so poised. You're so poised. I am. Are you kidding you're me? So, yeah. You're so, like, yeah. dignified. So th- that's right. why I want to hear something gross from you. <laughs> First of all, can I can I address? Go to issue koto. This might this is the chip on my shoulder. I hate it when people say I'm so dignified and and all that, because I'm thinking, who are you looking at? <laughs> like really, do you know? You, do, me, you like, understand where it comes from, though. We talked no, about this earlier. No, Gina. A week look, ago. Tin Tin knows this. Mm-hmm. Gina knows that I'm I'm really crazy. <laughs> I'm, I'm not what he, the, every day he says to me like when we used to work together they'll I had so much respect for him. <laughs> <laughs> I can't ask to get to that point yes please win uh-oh. <laughs> Please disrespect me as soon as possible, okay? But, but, tell, but tell, you know where it comes from, though. I mean, as much as, as, much no, as you no, don't I really like it, you know where it comes from. I mean, you're even your, your rushers probably feel the same way that you are no, a respectable... I think it's because of the way I talk. I think it, it's like a teacher, maybe, or True. something like that. Mm-hmm. That they think I... I I don't know what it is, but it's not my problem. I'm just going to talk. Teach us about the regla. Go. <laughs> regla. Anong gusto, anong gusto mo alamin? As yeah. if naman, di mo alam about regla. I have... You are a married man. Right. You would know. I mean, when you were single, probably. <laughs> but not as a married man. <laughs> right? Atras ka. Atras ka. Atras ka. Oh, no. But I think for Mo, it mm. happens so infrequently now na kahit ano pa lumalabas dyan sige game ako <laughs> and you know that's funny and, 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 and Mikey maybe one day as you know you, you get married you'll you go through this is when as, and I don't know if your husband Del does this but as a couple you, you share a restroom nakalivin ka na ba no, Mikey you ever live yes. with your girlfriend yeah okay okay so ito right? this is gonna sound really like misogynistic or whatever so <laughs> you're you're you're, sh- you're sharing the restroom now. Yeah. That, okay. that's what it is you live in mm-hmm. and then you go to the trash so nagwiwiwi ka so maga na standing up there baby and then you look into the trash and you oh, see that yeah. there's a pad and you're like 
No Ay, chance. Sige, ito walang action. Walang oh, action for like three days. Yes. Ah, yun ang nasa isip niya. Oh, walang action. Okay, okay. Araw ko. Sira na yung araw ko. Yeah, yung PI. Uh, yes? Yes, Mike? Yeah, for sure. That's that's what enters my yeah. mind pag ganun. Not kadiri. Yeah. Not like there was action anyway, right? But this just confirms <laughs> that there's no chance this yeah, week. No chance. You already started with a 10% chance of getting any, <laughs> like, any luck. And then you look at the pad and you're like, oh God, there it goes. my 10% chance. Yeah. <laughs> Tin, what are you thinking of? I just want to see Definitely where sucks. if I'm really sick. What are you thinking of, Tin? At what this moment mean? that they're talking about, like how do you feel? As a... ta- yeah, when they're talking about the women in their lives having periods, mm. and they're like, "Oh man, we can't have action for three days." Yeah. What's going on in your mind? Uh, I just want to okay. see if we're on the same wavelength. <laughs> I remember I said this on the show. Our topic was what was the last thing you said. Right before you lost your virginity. Right. Yeah. Oh, we got to do that topic again. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I, I, right. yeah we yeah. need to what get that. That was the very answer? last phrase you yeah. said. Yeah. Yeah. So mine was, I didn't want, pakase. Parang, I didn't want to give my flower. So, <laughs> <laughs> why did you have so to I whisper said, it? <laughs> so I said, <laughs> um, it's like commercial. <laughs> I can't. Eh. I, meron ako eh. I said, meron ako eh. So I used it as an excuse. Oh, uh, right. Yeah. Uh, but even if wala, 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 yeah. I didn't have Nagamit it. I just yeah. didn't want to give my flower yet. So he yeah. th- he responded with, "Pano ako makatulog dito sa hotel?" Nagamit sa akin yun tina. So um, so I can't be offended. Now they're saying, "Oh, wala ako action." If I know na I use that line to avoid action. Totoo. Yeah. Mm. yeah. We're really mm. gets. Uh, but but it didn't work though. Yeah, it didn't work. <laughs> it didn't work. No, okay. because the first one was the last. Wait, it didn't work. No, because the, 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 the line the, the, is, the what, is line. The, what is the phrase? What was the last phrase you said right before? Popoy. No, but it didn't, like, it didn't what work. Was, Sin, there's a guy? Uh, hindi nagbako? No, because no, because they had sex. They had sex. Uh, no, I know, but, but why didn't he back off? Flower has been given. Why didn't he back off? But Misha go. I would back off for sure. Uh, why? Guess you can back yeah, off a you bit. You know. <laughs> <laughs> it's still a fully functioning vagina. Mike. It is. <laughs> it's a functioning vagina, Mikey. Mm. There's a shower. Yeah. You can get creative. Right. right. All I'm saying is menstruation is not always a door okay, that's there. been slammed mm. shut on sex. Right. But it's right. not. I think, oh, I'm not that, a fan. That, are you, are, oh. Is it okay with you, Del? Like, are, are you fine with it? I don't like it. Am I a fan? Well, all I'm saying is I I I like the many forms of sex. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh. I mean, you, you have to be. Yeah. And I, the I'm reason not a fan is of the cleanup, I guess, after, you know? Okay, can, can I can I, okay, hold on. Can I ask Dora? Dora. I'm sure in your in sure I'm sure in your career you've had some butt sex where poo comes out, right? Yes. No. <laughs> What? No, yeah, it's normal. Yes, Del. It's okay. She said yes, yeah. Del. We've explored this. Even when you guys date no, when you guys date, I mean, some of my friends, because they, when, eat when ice they cubes. go on dates, they always tell me, yeah, they eat ice cubes, they do the lavage thing, uh, the enema, they do all yeah. that. Yeah, but there's a Dora. You think no. so? Um, when you do the complete this cleanse, is... wala. Okay, I know, but you have experience. Yes. Do we want the Quentong Kadire from me? Yes. Uh, uh, tomorrow, okay, tomorrow, tomorrow, we will because we'll revisit this because edition. we're running out of time. Like we're running out of time. <laughs> but but my thing is, when that happens, you just disregard. Yeah. It's, it, that's the thing with the, with the, with the menstruation sex as well. It's like okay, it's there. I get it. It's fine. But you disregard. Mm-hmm. You're not gonna shove your face in there. But you know, you're not also going to because I, I feel like if I were having. Uh, you know, uh, Dora, with you. Of course. Wow. <laughs> um, and and some and some. Uh, Del some, uh, <laughs> let's try to be scientific. Some dume came out. Yeah. This is what I would do. I'd be like, oh, you know, <laughs> yeah. Um, Kobe, sa- <laughs> Kobe, sabi nga nila, um, if if um the guy, if your top is parang scared of the dume, okay, then maybe he's too young for you. Oh. Yeah. Okay, but but okay. Here's the difference. Right? But so if we if yeah if we're doing it, thank you. For the pun. <laughs> when we're do, we're doing it, I'll just pick it up and toss it like it's nothing. Toss it like it's a cotton, no yeah. problem, right? But if you came to my house, para lang to my sa kama ko, it's a different story. Well, yeah. now we have conflict. Yeah. Right? There's a fight here. <laughs> so again, as as almost kind of a coming of full circle with everything we've talked about today, motive is everything. Yes. Motive context. is everything. Mm. Context, motive. 
Yeah. And thigh. <laughs> <laughs> All the way. Wow. Menstrual sex. Baptism of fire. Yeah. And kids, that's how you do a radio show for the first time. Ah, <laughs> oh, that was here. Wait till we invite you to our WhatsApp that's how you get group, Delamar. though. It's called Tae yeah. 2021. <laughs> that's the name, of the, the name of the chat room is Tae 2021. Guess who of the five of us gave that title? <sighs> Is it ten? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and and when I was talking to Dell before she got on the show last week, I said, uh, "Be careful with Susie. Her humor is Thai humor." <laughs> and where are we today? <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> what was the climax of today's show? <laughs> Couldn't help. It. Wow. Couldn't resist. <laughs> right. I did not expect it to sound like this. Okay. Yeah. This what is, were you uh, expecting this is it to sound like? a new thing for me. What were you like, coming into? Like, what did you I think know, we would actually, do that's today? That's a real. That's a great question. Um, I guess it wasn't an expectation of, I get, I don't know, seguro it's just my training, uh, like the kind of, the kind of, naku ang hirap nitong sabihin, di ba, without, um, katin ko ba ang nakaraan mo? Yes! No, it's just, no, it's just a different way of, of, of doing morning shows. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. in my head, so I'll, I'll tell you where I'm coming from. So, if I'm looking at, if I'm, thinking of the listener they're getting in their cars or getting ready for work I don't know that that's exactly what they would like to hear but then I know a lot of people who love that kind of talk right so I guess I'm in the middle like I don't know well I guess hmm. I have to learn I, I, have, I, I, I think you'll warm up to I, don't know. It. I think you'll warm up to it. and, you, and you'll <laughs> realize here I think and I'm not I'm not comparing magic to RX but I'm just comparing magic as magic that mm. the 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 I wouldn't say the rules are lax here but I think the management is a bit more tolerant to explore the limits of our humor and the limits of our conversation and the limits of what our topics are going to be um and I, and again, I don't know if that's what it looked like in, in, in you know back in your last station, but at least I think that's what you will experience here in in the few weeks that you'll be with us. So uh, let's just embrace it, enjoy it, and you'll get really upset when we start taking the recorded part of this <laughs> show and then start editing it out in different order. So for oh, example, no. when I go to Dora, I say, Dora, tell us about your butt sex. Del, how do you feel? I enjoy all aspects of sex. <laughs> and I can imply that you're a fan of anal as well. That's what oh we do God. here on the show. That's that's the part you're going to get mad at. That's the clip that we oh. promote on IG later. Is that true? No, it's not true. That's not true. Can that happen? No, 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 no. no, 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 no. <laughs> no. <laughs> First and last. No, 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 no. Well, I'll just tell you, uh, Tian, when, when Mo, me and Mo were doing this, this uh, equip, figuring out this equipment thing, he kept telling me, okay, so um, well, what would you be offended about? Tell me now so we don't go there. Right. Hey, he was prepping me. So I go, Mo, it's going to be so tedious for me to tell you, like, don't talk about this, don't talk about that. Don't. Mm-hmm. Why don't you just come as you are? Yeah. Yeah. And then I'll come and then as we'll I am. The limit, yeah. And everybody else will do that. And then if we get pushback from each other, then you do with with, with that with that whatever you want. You want to step back just because somebody pushed you back or you want to double down? That's mm-hmm. up to you. That's the show. The conversation is the show. So I'm right, right, right. don't worry, I'm not offended. It's just very different. And I, but I like different things. But but they'll be, be know that there is a venue just in case we have a safe word here. And I think you're supposed to have a safe word in any kind of very BDM. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's mm, what I mean. you have to have a safe, have word, a safe, word, safe word, word in any way. sticky. Why did yeah, I know the safe word? word? I need well, that well, word. No, <laughs> no, 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 I want no. the safe so word. I need that, that bad. Sa- word. Safe word equivalent is probably the best way to say it. We have our WhatsApp, uh, our group, chat room. Yeah. And many times, especially with this group, that we've teased each other about something. And you go, sh- while mid-bullying, you go into that room and you go, stop, mm-hmm. we're out. Okay, we do yeah. have that. Casey does it more than yes. anyone else. Uh, he yes. hits that safe word button <laughs> constantly. What's the safe word? Just There's stop. no word. It's, 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 just, it's stop. Yeah, yeah. it's just stop. Uh, no just more. Usually and, and will. It, yeah. Yeah, or not funny, Liba. Right? Yeah. Uh, Casey hits that button as if he's calling his maid. Like, Tin hits it every now and then, not as a way nowhere near as much as I Casey does. Dora. He has once. Once. I have one. He has once. Once, but yeah. it was the most dramatic one. <laughs> right. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, I cried. Yeah, I need that. Cried. I need that. Okay. Now yeah. I know. Yeah. Can we make Mikey cry next? Okay. Oh, Mikey, if Mikey ever presses the button, you might as well. That that's also fired button, Mikey. So when you press that, you're off the show. Mikey, you should be more bayaran yung muna ako. Tangas man lang, tangas. Oh no. Who is that? Speaking of, I don't know how much I'm getting paid. I don't know. 
Okay, okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> Same long to, same long to. This is an unpaid internship. Yeah, three out of the five. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my okay, gets. <laughs> I'm gonna message Welcome boss to again magic. later. <laughs> Pero, yeah. Oh, no rules, but no pay. <laughs> <Uh-oh>. <laughs> Maka-cancel na ako. Wala pang bahan. <laughs> Canceled na. Wala pang. <laughs> Was, Mikey's gonna get fined for something he said on the show. Wala pa siyang bayan. Super right? abonado. <laughs> abonado pa. Cancelled now. I, mean, I, I, I got fine. What are I going to do? I got suspended. Getting cancelled. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh man. Wow. Um, but anyway, you know we're we're really really behind. I expected this. I think, okay, Sorry, I know. Mo, I told you. We need to extend yeah. to like. Well, not today. Maybe tomorrow. Oh, this is not Let's my call. This is Delamar yeah. call. Oh, sorry. I, this is a Del. No, no. This no, is go. this is Delamar's yeah. thing. I'm gonna put go, it on go. her. I'm I'm okay. I'm I think it's too. It's bitten. We First of all, because Susie, we have I two ask? giants on the show. Yeah. Okay, well, may I add, may I add, I was always pro-extending this show. If there's any pushback, it comes from your ass. I can say, so do not sit there. Like Here we go again. Kind I of love this diet. I kept diet. saying, hanggang, let's do ako. until 10. Ang dami kong ginagawa. Nakita mo ba yung schedule ko? 7.30. La, 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 la. I said until That's 10. You. Until 10. Oh, shut your face. I said <laughs> I'm okay with it though. Oh. <laughs> Kailangan ng popcorn dito. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. No, so especially recently, recently, man. Susie, Susie, Susie's got turned into this like ultra diva. That's not true. At a time true. where you don't want to be, and uh, that is true. I told Del this. I told Del that I'd not say this. When to you you start many this, can I just tell you? Uh, when when somebody accuses you of being a diva, mm-hmm. never say I am not. <laughs> <serious>. <laughs> How dare you? God, how dare how you? Very Talk dare to me you. that way. <laughs> how dare you, you unpaid <laughs> masses? <laughs> Tell me that I am diva. Uh, but yeah, I, I hope, again, you know, serious conversation that we had for an hour aside. I hope you had fun here on uh, day one. Right. 